All right. So now this is verse 20. Then shall stand up in his estate a razor of taxes in the glory of the kingdom. Now, the, uh, the, the, the main king at this time was Seleucus IV. Um, I forget his uh, surname, but it was Seleucus IV, and he set up Heliodorus. Now, Heliodorus was the raiser of taxes when you read in the, the verse, verse 20. Okay, it says, Then shall stand up in his estate a raiser of taxes in the... Con. Seleucus the fourth. Love of the father, yep. Right, because Philometa, there was one that was called uh, Theos, was Antiochus Theos, if I'm not mistaken. And Theos means God. Because they looked, they looked at them to themselves as being gods. Antiochus Epiphany looked to himself as being the embodiment of Zeus. So these these people were not all there in the head, man. They they were big headed, man. But uh, Phil, uh, Philometa, one, uh, which was one of the Ptolemies, the word Philometa was uh, the word means uh, loved his mother, and Philopater means loved his father, lover of his father. All right. All right, so back in verse 20. Then shall stand up in his estate a raiser of taxes in the glory of his king of the kingdom, but within few days he shall be destroyed, neither in anger nor in battle. And that was Seleucus IV, Philopater, who sent Heliodorus, you know, into uh, Jerusalem, and he feigned himself as if he was just going there just to see what they had, and basically he wanted to plunder it. But what happened was the angels whooped his ass and sent him back, back home, you know? And, and you know what? Let's, let's